Hi guys, it's Beverly. Here's my craft show table. So there's some of those kitchen towels. I made the toppers and the snowman one that goes on the stove. And then I have some turkey pot holders. Next to that are the Swifford for the floor dust covers, the Swiffer dusters with the handle, and my scrubbies. I got to make some of them. Those are the refrigerator door handle covers, you know, because they get all sticky. And then I have a bunch of coasters. And there's a toilet paper cover that looks like an owl and the granny panties now this is my baby sweaters and there's some um loveys i made some football hats there's the owl hats and the headbands keyhole scarves and some shawls that i made and then over on this way we had a tree but it's a fall tree because it had all leaves on it it didn't have christmas yet it was thanksgiving and then this is my friend wendy's table she has a lot of jewelry items and what i'm looking at right now is those little shirts they they hold kleenexes and here's her assortment of jewelry ear earrings and items and then here she has um this is another ladies she did those bowl cozies she had a lot of the um professional teams and she had pot holders and placemats and some hanging towels but she didn't really display them so you could see them and then this woman had those 3d dimensional cards so that's basically what we had at the craft show first and then we're going to talk about the items that i sold and i have to remake and the yarns that i use so hopefully you'll enjoy it okay i hope you guys enjoyed the video of the craft show now what i wanted to do was talk about some of the items that i sold and some of the yarns that i use so um i did sell a the baby boy uh hat and sweater set and in a little bit i'm going to show you uh, the yarn i use and a pair that i've made um i sold that one of the owl toilet paper covers and i use the super saver in the color Aaron fleck so i've got to make one of those replacements and i still use a lot of super saver um i like how it comes out but i am switching to some different yarns as you'll see when we go along here So out of the Erin Flex Super Saver, I've made some owl hats, scarves, and uh, headbands, and also the owl gloves. In this worsted, this is from Hirschner's, and this is the worsted eight um, because it has an eight ounce skein, and it's so cool because it comes with a little pull. And I'm going to be using this to make a black owl hat because it's sold out. And then this one here, it's not really coming out gray, but it is a gray. I think they even call it silver. And this is from uh, Hobby Lobby, the yarn B, sleek and soft. And I really do like this. I bought some of this in the oatmeal color. And I sold two hats, owl hats, made out of the oatmeal color. And this is silver, even though it might not be coming out so silver. The next one is a Super Saver yarn, and it's called Dark Sage. Sorry, my hand keeps getting in there. The Dark Sage, I made a owl hat out of that, and I'm hoping that there's enough here to make another owl hat. Moving on, I have a red heart here, and this is called Light Gray. 
Now the light gray, I sold a scarf and an owl hat. Um, it's the lacy scarf. If you hopefully you'll check out my uh, Etsy shop, I'm gonna link it below so you can you know see the items in my shop. Okay, next I have uh, this is an owl hat that sold out. This is in the aqua color, and this is uh, Bernat Super Value, and. I don't remember purchasing this. This might have been something I won in a contest, but it's it's an aqua color, and you you can see the brown buttons. I use mostly these brown buttons for the owl. Hopefully, you can see the owl. A lot of people, when they're looking at them during the craft show, they really don't see the owl, and I have to point it out to them. But this is definitely better uh, better or softer than the um red heart and like i said i'm i'm moving away from it uh and eventually but so far you know everything's going good with the red heart okay i'm back now next door here i do have some super saver and this is the Aaron color now i have sold several hats and scarves and as you can see for some reason these might be two different dye lots because they're coming out a little different in shade uh, and again I'm phasing going to be phasing this yarn out after I use what I have but it's been a good seller for me uh, I'm planning on making uh, a pair of gloves with that and I'll be using the same brown eyes okay these two skeins of yarn we're kind of on the bottom row and there wasn't any more left but this just yarn and this is in the colorway where is it cream just yarn and I'm planning on making a pair of uh, owl gloves out of that and just the two of these together you can feel the softness difference so that's why I'm going to be phasing out some of this. Okay, so I mentioned that I sold the baby sweater and with the booties and the hat. Now this is coming out um, a little darker than it actually is. And my finger's in the way. So this is the light blue Premier Basic that I use for the sweaters and the blankets. And I've also been using um, Bernat Super Value. I did get a deal on some of the um, baby blue. And so you have to buy at least three to six skeins of this so that you can make the whole complete set. The sweater, the blanket, and the hat, and the booties. And I, this is my favorite booty pattern, you guys. It's so easy. And then the look of the booty is just sensational. Okay, now back here, impeccable from Michaels. And this is, doesn't say, just says impeccable, doesn't have any other description. And this is called Bright Blue Sky. And I sold this out of this hat. Uh, it's an owl hat, so I've already got the owl buttons on it and uh, I'm working on this hat now and again the color is a little bit more towards the aqua side where it's coming out you know kind of uh, royal blue or blue in my video and this hat sold out right away at my craft show in my community and let's see oh the adult hats i need to make two adult football hats and then the aqua hop and the off-white gloves so i have quite a few items that i need to make and scrubbies you saw that little bucket <laughs> or dishpan full of scrubbies and so i need to make about 30 scrubbies and i use the tool for that um i talked about before that i got a really good deal on some tool and so I got to be making them things really quick. But I think I'm going to concentrate on getting all the owl hats done and then going from there. But I did finish the baby blue sweater and you saw the hat and booties. 
and so that's working out good and so today is the 20 first I think whatever and so that means I have several days before December 4th so that's kind of what I'm up to you guys um I packaged up Ella from no catching name her um, vlogmas yarn swap and uh, I'm in the secret Santa with Christie's uh, Christie's closet and I've got the yarn picked out but I she says we don't have to mail it to December 15th so I think I'm gonna concentrate on something nice to wrap up the yarn for my secret Santa but I can't decide if I should tell the person you know with a card in there who sent it or not so you guys let me know and um, I'll take a look at the comments and then I'll change you know decide based on the number of your comments because I've done secret Santas before but then I kind of spoil it and so it might be kind of fun to have the person wonder for a little while, but it might be mean too. <laughs> so anyway, I hope you guys like this video. Um, I'm enjoying doing these. I can't wait till December to do Vlogmas. And um, we, I had fun with Sue the other day when we did our little uh, crochet chat. And so you guys know what I'm doing. I'm focusing on replenishing my inventory from my successful craft shows. So you guys take care. Love you. Bye. Hugs and hugs. Um, don't forget my premiere link below if you need some yarn. And buy me a cup of coffee. Bye, guys.